To set up a group queue in QLab, all you need to do is click on the group icon in your toolbar and that will create a group queue into your queue list. We're going to renumber this as queue number five and we're going to place it at the top of our queue list. You can then use existing audio files that are in your queue list to create your group or you can import new audio files into your group. Once you have the files, you need to then just drag and drop the audio files you want in your group into your group in the order that you want them in your group, like so. Once you have selected all the files into your group, you then need to choose the mode that you want your group to run in. You do this by clicking on the Mode tab at the bottom. You will see there are four modes available to you. The first one, start first child and enter into the group. When your group is in standby mode and you trigger the first queue, it will play the first queue and then put into standby the next queue and as you trigger it will trigger all the queues in the order of your group. The next option available to you is start first child and go to next queue. When your group is in standby mode and you trigger to go it will play the first queue and then automatically put into standby the next available queue in your queue list bypassing all other queues in your group. The third option start all children simultaneously when your group is in standby mode and you trigger it to go, it will trigger all the audio files in your group at the same time and start playing them together. And finally, start random child and go to next queue. When your group is in standby mode and you trigger it to go, it will pick a random audio file to play and then automatically skip the rest and standby on the next available queue in your queue list.